Uh, how are you guys doing, Eric here? Today's Sunday, February 25th, 2018. And I'm fucking working today, man. This is my fourth day in a row I've been sick. I, I called in sick for two days. Yesterday I was just fucking shitty sick, man. I was just, oh my God. And I called in and, you know, my boss is like, I'll see you tomorrow. So I was like, fuck. I had to come in today because they're shorthanded. But I shouldn't be here, man. I'm fucking, I should have called in sick, man. I really, and this is, I'm taking my life into my hands here, man, really. As cold as it is, and I've fucking been, my, my system is all weakened. You know, I could easily catch pneumonia and fucking die. But hopefully that won't happen, man. I'll fucking survive through. This is like the eighth day in a row of this fucking Arctic cold snap. And today it's fucking shitty, dude. The wind's blowing. It's like in the single digits. I didn't think it was going to be this cold, man. I really didn't. I thought, you know, thought it was going to be like oh, around 20 degrees or something. Not so bad. Man, I'm out of my mind, dude. I should not be here. I should. This is just pissing me off, though, because I know that this whole fucking Arctic cold snap is fucking weather manipulation, man. The fucking the New World Order is trying to fucking kill off as many people as they can with this fucking cold weather, man. No doubt about it in my mind, man. That's what's going on. They're just keeping it fucking cold for fucking. It's gonna be. I think this cold snap is gonna last for like into March. It's insane, dude. Just, we never stay cold this long. Oh uh, yeah, this is this is fucking bitter, man. This is this is fucking weather manipulation at its worst, man. This is uh, this is this is killing people, man. It's fucking killing me. But anyways, I got this. I got some medicine here, so I'm gonna take some of that. Try to eat a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I got a burrito cooking down below. See if I can survive through this day. Fucking miserable, man. I should not be here. So shitty fucking cold out, man. My fucking feet are freezing. My hands are stinging. Uh, I got a headache. My board, the bindings are frozen up, so I had to bring it inside. To, so that hopefully the bindings will, will fucking thaw out so it won't go flying off my feet. Oh man, I'm just a miserable son of a bitch today. God. I should be at home in bed. <laughs> yeah, another problem I'm having working here at IP today, Indian Peaks. The fucking, this heater right here fucking sucks. You gotta get right up on it to get warmed up. And the floor is fucking cold as fucking ice. So it freezes your boots up. Uh, the bottom heater is pretty good, but there's, there's, they're missing a, a, one of the windows got busted out and it's been busted out all season long So it doesn't hold any warm air in there. So I got really nowhere to warm up very well so Yeah, dude, that I, I, this this could be my last day man on earth I might I might just fucking catch pneumonia today. I hope not I, I'm not trying to but Hey, here comes the sun through the window. That's helping. But see, look at all these windows are fogged up and frozen. Can't see out. It's just fucking hell on earth this morning, man. I hate to be such a whiny little bitch, but I'm sick. Fucking sick. I got a sore throat. I got a headache. And then on the van up on the, I had to catch the van in Netherlands this morning and ride up. And they're fucking cranking this oldies music in there with static behind it. And that wasn't helping my headache at all, so I'm just sitting there going, oh man, I gotta endure this fucking torture, man. I got some orange juice here, maybe that'll help. But then I come to find out that all the fucking orange juice that you buy in the stores are all not good for you, full of all kinds of shitty sugar products. Everything you buy to eat, nothing's fucking good for you, man. God, it's just, you just can't fucking win these days, man. Yeah, the fucking orange juice is all full of fucking all kinds of horrible sugars that aren't good. You know, it's not like real squeezed orange juice that you can buy in the store anymore. It's all, it's all produced by the fucking Rothschilds. They bought up all the food corporations. The peanut butter and jelly is all full of high fructose corn syrup and fucking polysaturated fucking canola oils that are fucking 
cancer causing, you know, you just, oh, it's so fucking horrible the world we live in, man. One good thing is my water, man, I, I think, I'm not sure, but you know, it's it's well water from my property and it's filtered with my with that Brita pitcher I got, so, but who knows, man, even if that's enough, man, it, with all the shit, who knows, I, I have a feeling that the shit that they put on the roads, the de-icer and shit, is all toxic. And that goes down into our well. And they do it on purpose to poison the fucking well. Just poison the well and scorch the fucking earth. Yeah, my last video, I was all cocky saying, oh, I'm gonna kick this flu's ass. That was two days ago and I'm still fucking sick. Yeah, this is one of the worst, vi one of the worst strains I've ever had in my life. And I know it's been genetically engineered by the fucking CDC with their fucking flu shots and that's how they get it out there to the fucking it's all, it's all an insidious fucking plot to kill as many Americans as they can with their cold weather and their fucking manufactured fucking flu but anyways I got some medicine in me I forced down a peanut butter and jelly sandwich force fed myself that drank some of that orange juice and so I should have enough calories and vitamins to survive through the day. And then we're dealing with this fucking weather manipulation cold snap and no relief in sight. Eight days in the deep freezer and no fucking relief in sight. That's very unusual around here. Usually we get cold for a day or two and then it warms right back up. Tell me this ain't fucking weather modification, man. I ain't buying it. Yeah, it's a pretty fucking horrible situation we're in here, man. Fucking controlling the weather. Fucking controlling the fucking viruses. Fucking poisoning the food. Putting fluoride in the water. It's the only good thing I got going on, is it? I know there's no fluoride in my water. That's the only thing I know for sure. Yeah, another thing that sucks about being sick for four days in a row is that I fucking feel weak, man, you know? I've been working here for, I don't know, a month and a half, and I built up a lot of strength, man. When I first started, I was pretty weak, man. And I, it, takes, it takes a while when you get to be my age to build your strength back up, and then I get sick, and I lose a lot of that strength that I had built up, and I'm out there trying to work, and it's it's tough, man. So, yeah, that's, that's another thing that I'm, I'm, I'm whining about today. Oh, fuck. Man, it's going on one o'clock. It's one of the one of the most miserable. Looks like they're getting ready to shut down Corona for the win. We're gonna we're gonna be going on wind hold here. Sounds like. Anyways, yeah, it's been the most. God, these guys want to shut the fuck up. I'm trying to make a video here for fuck's sakes. <laughs> I gotta hear what's going on. Right? Yeah. This has been the most miserable day of my life, man. Pretty much. I mean, except for maybe when I was in jail. But, yeah. But I'm fucking fighting through it, man fight through my injuries, I fight through my sicknesses, through miserable weather, with the fucking, the worst flu that the fucking Center for Disease Control could throw at me. And I will survive, motherfucker. Yep, they're shutting, we're shutting down. We are shutting down, motherfucker. That sucks, that means I'm gonna be. That means we, I'm gonna be stuck up here for fucking who knows how long. That sucks balls. Hopefully we don't be on it. Hopefully we're not on wind hold very long before they just send us home. Here comes Eric Larson, old friend of mine. 
Oh my god, what a fucking day we've had. I don't know, it's probably about 1.30 or so. And we are on wind hold, which sucks balls. Which means I gotta sit up I gotta sit up here for at least an hour. And then if they decide to shut it down or sit for another I, I think they'll shut it down. I hope maybe they'll shut it down before the hour, but man, I think I'll take a nap. Anyways, it's been a fucked up day, man. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you guys soon. One thing about this shack, though, it's, it's a tough place to take a nap, but I'm going to do it. i got to be in here for at least 25 minutes. Hopefully, we'll, shut, we'll, we'll call it a day at that point. Damn it. They just extended the, lit, the wind hold for another half hour at least to at least 2.30 now. Fuck. I want to go home. Sleep. And recover from this fucking deadly illness that I got. God damn it. Fucking 2.30. And they, they just said, we're gonna, I've been up here for an hour on wind hold. And they just said that wind hold is going to go till 3 o'clock. And they'll let us know then if we're going to stay, if we're going to, uh, motherfucker. We're closed at 3.30 anyway, for fuck's sakes. Oh, well. I guess I'll just go work on the ramp. Try to pass another half hour. And they're going to open up for a half hour and close. It's fucking retarded, man. Anyways, man, it is so fucking deathly cold out there, man. It's like it's some kind of fucking cold in the air. Something weird like I've never felt before, man. It's just maybe it's because my lungs are all fucked. And I'm coming down with pneumonia or something. But, man, it really feels like some kind of chill that I've never felt in my life. It's deathly.